The PGA of America was founded in 1916, and they are celebrating their centennial this year. And to commemorate a century of the PGA's dedication to growing the game of golf, we will take a closer look at each of their 41 sections over the next few months. Located in Riverside, Iowa, the Iowa PGA section was founded in 1936 and is made up of 247 members and apprentices. It covers the entire state of Iowa and parts of western Illinois. The president of this section is John Valier. The Iowa PGA section established the Give Foundation, Give standing for Golf for Injured Veterans Everywhere in 2007. Since its inception, more than 700 veterans and their families have been introduced to golf through the Give Foundation. I was uh, drafted during the Vietnam War. How'd you get your injury? I went through an uh, explosion with C4, which took out uh, most of my sight immediately. Eldon is, is a very remarkable individual. He was in our very first class in 2007. Uphill or level or downhill? Uh, it's level. Yeah, and you've got uh, about three feet. All I can definitely see now is just uh, light and dark. Got it. Dead center. Nice putt. Eldon persevered. We got him to where he could have a pretty repetitive swing. You've seen how I golf today due to the fact that Jim doing a great job of instructing. Good ball, Eldon. The Give Foundation has given them a, a opportunities to come out and, and learn something about the game of golf. But I think more importantly, giving them a, an avenue to rehabilitate socially, emotionally, physically as well. Got to take care of soldiers, you bet. And Marines too. Yeah. <laughs> Seen incredible uh, stories where veterans have been very recluse, wouldn't come out of their house for two and a half years. Okay, we're at the tee. You do not know what it means to get out of the house and do something that other people take for granted. Some of our guys, um, traumatic brain injured, you know, they come to us say, well, there's no way. I hate the word can't because can't won't get you anywhere. And that's something that Jim installed is can. We can do it. We will do it. And that changes, you know, lives, changes perspectives. I want every disabled person out there, whether they're a veteran or not, to go out there and go for it because it can be done. <laughs> And tomorrow, we will take a look at the Middle Atlantic section of the PGA of America right here on Morning Drive. And when we continue, you want value if you're going to go on a couple's trip? Well, our travel expert has all the information coming up next. I knew I wanted to be like my dad and be a PGA member. Following him around as a kid, I would get to see the players. I didn't really know them, but they knew me because I was Davis's son. You know, we lost him too early. Coming up the 18th fairway at Wingfoot, knowing that I'd won the PGA Championship, and then to see the rainbow, and everybody associated that rainbow with my dad watching over me. I'd like to thank him for just instilling in me what it means to be a professional and be a PGA member. The best stories end in thanks. Share your story at thanksPGAPro.com.